Hey there, you big wiener heads. Hey there, you big wiener heads. Blue here. Today we are back with another episode of Life is Strange, as said in the title right there. Yay! And I actually figured out how to turn the video volume down. It was kind of sad because I never noticed that there's a help in options right here. And that's why my music was blasting all the time. So hopefully you could hear me a little better this episode. I might be yelling a little bit louder just so you guys could hear me. But thanks for coming in. If you're watching this right now, thanks so much for coming in every single day um, for watching my videos. It's really appreciated. We're almost at 100 subscribers. I really appreciate it. And um, yeah, just thanks. Thanks a lot, guys. I really, I'm not even kidding how much I appreciate it. But um, we are, it looks like we are on the main campus of the, what? Oh, we're probably on the school campus doing something. I forgot where we were we're actually at but my dog's trying to get out of my room real quick so i'll be back okay that was a little awkward way to start the video but let's just get started how about that okay oh yeah we're on the next episode aren't we um is this the last one i i'm pretty sure which what episode are we on guys we did that are we on four are we on four or that i think we're on four let's check it out yeah, we're at four. Okay, let's start this. Oh, I haven't been doing this for a while, so... Yeah, we're almost actually done with the series of Previously Life is Strange. on Life is Strange. Oh, we gotta watch this. Whoa. Oh, this is the start. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Don't ever touch me again, freak! Holy crap. This is a long time ago. Bow, bow, bow. Let's talk about your superpower. What are you doing here, Max? Pushing Stop. you off a ledge. Don't come near me. Not now. It won't work. Uh oh. I know good. this isn't. I remember all this. This was a long time ago. Miss Caulfield, please days. tell us everything. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. That's bow, Rachel's bracelet. Why the bow, fuck are you wearing bow, her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Max, we I have love to this find music Rachel like soon. so much. Holy like crap. you said, it's time it's to start beautiful. the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max, you better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than a friend. Oh my god. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Life so is strange. To blame? My Definitely. fucking dad, of course. Hello? No, you don't. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Bow. Chloe, Bow. I am awesome. Bow. We are awesome. Bow. 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 Hello? Are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. Oh no, what else I remember where we left off. Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe! Oh you god. Have a visitor. This is the bad part. We did something bad, didn't we? I remember. Yep. That's where we left off. Oh god. Not good. Holy crap. Oh, there goes my dog. Oh, come on, man. Come on. Um. You might hear my dog barking because he is going crazy right now. <laughs> oh, shut up! Come on, man. I'm trying to record here. Holy crap, guys. I need to cut this real quick. Okay, hopefully he has stopped, but um, he's still barking a little bit. You might hear I can't really do anything to stop that, so let's just resume the game. A little crab! Oh my god, so cute. Holy crap. Holy crabs, get it? Ha ha ha. It's gonna get killed by the water. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny to see it like wash way up there. Seagulls? Why do they always show like birds in this game? Does this have do they have to do something with it or something? It's the game of birds. I like the starting of these episodes. They're like really cool. Bicycles. Once knocked over. I wonder who did that, probably Jimmy. Jimmy the crab, he probably knocked it over, trying to push it into the water. <gasps> the dead whales! Oh no! 
How the heck would they get washed way up there? They're like literally on a hill. That makes no sense. They're way too heavy to wash up there. I don't get how I could do that. Okay, Doki. I don't get what the point is and what we're looking at. But it looks pretty fun and crazy. Episode 4, Dark Room. Bom, bom, bom. It's like the longest game ever. Oh no. Chloe is totally jacked up. What did we do? We should have not changed that picture. Whoa, the whales are like all bloody. What the heck? That was awkward. It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. Aww. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. I hope she doesn't so die. Max, so pretentious. Hopefully we could fix this. But I love writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. Holy crap. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much, yeah. What happened to her, though? Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Aw. Those beached whales are so sad. That is actually pretty cool, that view, though. <laughs> I kind of know how they feel. At least, I'm alive. Like, what happened to all this stuff, though? Like, jeez. Chloe needs to tell us some stuff. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Talk about accident, blame William. Accident. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you Oh my god. Everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I wish we could rewind that. I felt my back snap and and that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. Rachel Am- Wait, you don't know Rachel Amber? What the heck? You mean Rachel Amber? When was the last time you talked to her? Uh, never. I just read about her in the news. What? I didn't even know her name. Oh my god! You did? This is, this is such horrible. a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. Um, wait, hold on guys. <laughs> Let me plug in my charger during the episode. There we go. I really have to do this. So sorry. Blah, 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 blah. Let's go. Okay. It might be you think, don't say that. I don't know. What? I don't even know what she just said because I just missed it. I'm gonna do it. Might be. It might be, but I'd like to think we can still change things for the better. I'd like to think that too, but I don't have much hope these days. I know things seem out of control, but as long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe. Oh, I feel so bad for I'm Chloe. I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. You're my best friend. Max, thanks for coming out to see me. Oh. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella? 
I hate that word. No offense. Are you kidding me? You said it like all those other times. I like the old Chloe actually more than this one. No offense. But it's actually kind of true. She has more fun. Okay, five years later. <laughs> Holy crap. This is actually pretty cool though. <gasps> the lighthouse. I feel like the whole story has to do something with that lighthouse. Like we had fixed everything. Can't wait to do this episode. Bow, bow, bow. I like wieners and my ketchup. What the hell? Their house looks a lot nicer than it used to look. <laughs> or, yeah. The house is like way nicer than it used to look. Oh, it's a pretty high tech lair. Feels like a high tech cell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you are here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Can't really talk, sorry guys. Chloe. As you know. You're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive. When you don't even have to be. Trust me. I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Oh my god, that'd be horrible. And doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks It's all Max's Max. fault. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? Now we can't tell Chloe to do it for herself because she's crippled. Gosh dang it, that sucks. <coughs> Holy crap. Um, where do we get the water? I feel like it's like really close, but I'm I just can't see. Where, oh my god, is this the hallway out? Bedroom, makeup, look, blah blah blah. Oh, here's water. There we go. There you go. Drink up, Buttercup. I don't think any water's oh, in there. No wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. Yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. Her whole room looks like, like way better. And her house and all her parents and stuff are like way better than they were last time. But I kind of like the old Chloe because, you know, she was more fun. Um, What do you remember? Seems like yesterday. What do you remember? What do you remember about us as kids? We all have different memories. I think about us as little pirates, running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. Oh yeah. Me too. But we're still pirates in our own way. <laughs> yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. No way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. Which friends? You have me. You have me. I'm not I'm leaving not you, leaving Chloe! Chloe. Well, you didn't visit me a lot either. Exact. Exact. I, mean, I loved words. your cards and photos, but quote by I know Sam. I wasn't around much. No excuses. I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. Oh, look at the little pink lizard in the background. Are you lonely? Are they okay? They love you. They love you so much. I know. My mom and dad are so cute. They always pop in here and make sure everything's okay with me. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks and the medical bills are fucking insane. I bet. Oh my god, it even says I bet. I didn't even know it would say that. Can they pay? I bet. I bet. This tech must be crazy expensive. 
along with the drugs, the nurses, the supplies. Mom and Dad are always broke, and they get so frustrated. Is it worth it? Chloe, you're priceless. Uh, <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. That's why I love you. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> what do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. Now let's get the <laughs> show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on That's actually pretty me. funny because she did have blue hair. Movies. I remember Max. Before Max Swear I won't ruined it. Not when you're here. Not yet. Okay, so we have to put on a movie. Um, okay, let's go. Okay, movie, movie, movie. Um, search. There's gotta be one in here, right? <sighs> Here's the DVD. Wow, first try, DVD player. Let's put it on DVD. Wow, I actually knew where it was this time compared to usual. Holy crap. What are they watching? This is very entertaining watching their face. Chloe has changed a lot. Holy crap. Make a wish. Danger zone. Oh my god, they're both sleeping on top of each other. Uh, <coughs> Who just coughed? What the heck? Was that Chloe? I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. How dare you? I know you were beat down after the day with me, and Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Uh, do you do you think Deckard is a replicant? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No, I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep on me. Oh you my God! Bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. Now Yesterday it's was such a blast. It was great seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates, jumping and running through the forests again. It meant a lot to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go upstairs and get my my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's what? Uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep this wag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? It's not bad for her though. I'm on it, Chloe. Oh well then. Okay, let's get the heck out of here. Open. So it's upstairs. No, I don't think Joyce's tips will cover all this. I think we need to talk to him so he doesn't. Okay, nah, I'm good. I'll just go. Don't want this episode to be too long, Victoria, or else you guys will be bored. I'm getting all these like message spams. Like, holy crap! Give me a break. Okay, let me do a save. Okay, messages. Holy crap! I have not looked at these for a while. Um, hopefully nothing's important, and let's get the heck out of here. So, it should be in the bathroom, but where's the bathroom? Is this it? Probably. 
Morphine, morphine, morphine. Shouldn't there be a light in here? I bet you guys can't see at all. It's so, like, dark. Holy crap. It's dark in here. Oh, here we go. Switch on. There we go. That's a lot better. Drawer, search. Nothing here. It's probably up here, then. Search. It's cool that Chloe uses natural medicine, too. Uh, where would it be, though? The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. Uh, morphine, morphine, morphine. Here it is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. That's pretty bad, though, isn't it? Let's get the heck down here. Left mouse, there we go. Hopefully you could hear me okay. I'm trying to do the best as I can with speaking louder than usual. You don't see me. You don't see me. We're good. Is this the door? Wait. Isn't that the, where the garage used to be, though? This used to be, like, the whole garage, wasn't it? Holy crap. It really has changed. Chloe morphine. Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And painless. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. What? Of course my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Yes! Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Okie dokie. Please. My diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. Ever. Okay. Where is it? It's probably this. Yeah, here it is. Take. Let's check these out with her. Over here. Photo album. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god. Look how little we are there. Oh my god, you can't like see toys. the picture. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Um, turn page. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over What's our so big about the, um... we had the chance. There's still time for you. What's so big about the pirate stuff? Like, what the heck? Turn page. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Me too. This photo... Maybe I could... Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and uh, and it's only getting worse. Uh-oh. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying... That being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible. And you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you. To be okay, no, okay. sorry about that. Do you understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. No, we can't kill her. What the heck? 
That's too much. Uh, I don't know. This is a really hard choice to do. Accept, refuse, I don't know. I gotta say, I don't know. Chloe, I, I really don't know if I can do this. I had another friend who wa wanted to end it all, and I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible for ending yours? I mean, th there's got to be another way. Max, you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help me the same way. Oh, I no. I want to help you, Chloe, but... I, th I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you can just do we it. We gotta go in the picture. Look at me. I'm at the mercy of everybody. For once, I want to make my own choice. The most important one of my life. Please. Oh no. Next. Don't do it. Go in the picture, please. Oh. Uh huh. We kind of have to now, though. What if I refuse? Can we go back in the picture? I feel like that would be a horrible choice, though. Well, I could always go back if it's a horrible choice. I'm going to refuse. Chloe. I can't. It wrecks me to see you in any pain. But I don't have any right to do this. I'm an adult. I'm giving you the right. But Joyce and William. I already said my goodbyes to them. But they won't honor my wishes. You will. Right? I, I can't kill you with an overdose. Max, I'm dying from my illness, not my dosage. Come on, don't kill her, please. This accelerates the process. Go back in the picture. I'd rather go out on a wave than a rock. And I want my best friend to help me out. Oh. I'm going to help you, but not like that. You have to believe me, Chloe. Why, Max? You're just bailing on me like everybody else. Why don't you go now? Oh, no. You've been wanting to since you got here, right? So go and don't come back. We have to go back in time and change that. Chloe, I am never leaving you again. Uh-huh. I can't just kill her, though. It's bad. I'm sorry, William. No, <gasps> we can do it. We gotta go back. We gotta focus on the picture, don't we? Focus with A and D keys. Um, then with left and mouse button. Okay, let's do that. A, and then D. Left, then right. Come on, focus. Focus a little more. Boom. Nope. We gotta get this, guys. This is, like, always hard for me. I don't know why. Come on, man. Focus a little faster. Let's totally focus. Get a little more up there. Come on, focus! This takes forever. Well, be back again. Okay, guys, I just got it. We're in the picture now. Again. Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. I'm this sorry, William. But we have to do this because Chloe is more important. <laughs> it's your daughter, I mean. Hello? Hey, honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Because we can't change time. That was what Shit, happened before. And I think Chloe needs to survive. You mean your college fund? I think this was actually a good choice. Aha! Uh -huh. You can't hide from me. Because William's forever. not that big of a character in this, really. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. That is when he dies. 
Well, there we go. Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I, I did try. I'm sorry. I don't oh, know no. exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. Yeah, we had you, Chloe. I'll always have your back. I don't care always. how she looks. Oh no. Bye, William. Oh, that's really sad. Should I have put her out? I don't know. She doesn't get the car, does she? Nope. Maybe I should have put her out. I don't know. It's that was kind of a hard choice. It was like 50-50. This is a long episode. We're gonna have to end it off pretty soon here though. What the heck? Whoa, that was really weird. Well, we're going to have to end it off for this episode on a cliffhanger. Um, next episode, we're going to see what happens if Chloe's alright. Um, this is this has been a really like amazing episode. I think that was actually pretty cool for the day. But anyways, I hope you guys keep your brothers blue on beside your subscribers. And we are also going to hopefully be playing factions um, either today or tomorrow. I don't know. It's kind of hard to decide like when you're actually going to play because you never know what's going to happen, you know. Um, but hopefully you guys have enjoyed this episode of Life is Strange. I know I have. It's like really cool. And hopefully you guys could actually hear me this episode. I didn't really talk too much but because of course it's a, you know, a story type game. And it's kind of strange, but it's actually kind of cool too. Uh, but anyways, keep it really blue. Bye-bye. Have a nice day.